So we got a couple new van items and one of the ones that we're pretty excited about, we've been wanting one of these, is a rooftop cargo bag that's waterproof so that we can have a weatherproof bag up there all the time to hold a lot of our stuff that's in the rack. It takes a lot of sun and weather damage all the time so hopefully this will protect a lot of the items that we have going up there. We got two of them and we're filling them full. And So it's a 38 by 38 bag. Danny's handing me the other one. They sent us two uh, right off the bat. They look pretty nice and durable. Um, I'm worried about these straps maybe ripping in the sun over time. But yeah, it's got nice uh, waterproof zippers. And it's really just gonna help keep our stuff from getting weathered. So I'm gonna put both of them in and yeah, Check these guys out. Just gonna kind of run through what they are real quick. They're great for this uh, roof rack here on my Sprinter van out here in uh, Mount Shasta area. So yeah, just right off the bat, it's got these uh, built-in straps. It's got two on each side. So it's got eight straps. They're all pretty straightforward. Just a classic like click. They're made out of a nice, uh, Pretty durable, actually very durable, waterproof uh, material here. And actually it has a pretty nice zipper on here. It's even a waterproof zipper. They say to keep the zipper to the front of your car. I'm in a big Sprinter van, so it doesn't really matter like how that's working for me. Obviously, if you're putting this on a car, you're gonna to wanna to prep the surface and put a mat down or something so you don't scratch it, but I got these nice bars to strap everything to. This thing's pretty uh, amazing, actually. I have all kinds of inflatable gear and wetsuits and all kinds of stuff in here. It holds 15 cubic feet. So I shove quite a bit of equipment in this bag. Um, you want to put the heaviest stuff in first. Makes life easier when you're loading it all up. Pretty obvious how you'll just put the um, bag on your roof or rack or whatever you got. Then you'll just uh, tighten all these straps down. I have them all strapped down to the, uh, the actual bars, steel bars on my roof rack. And then I just sometimes come up here every now and then and make sure it's secure. But yeah, I really like having these. They keep all my gear um, protected. It used to just kind of be in the sun and it all got really sun bleached. So now I have everything wrapped up in these nice bags. I highly recommend them if you are in an RV or on a road trip and need some extra space. They're a real bang for the buck. So check them out. Show the uh, logo again. But yeah, overall very nice uh, quality, pretty durable. We'll see how long they last, but they look all right. All right, guys, it's the uh, moment of truth. We're out here at our campsite. It was pouring rain earlier and the bags look uh, nice and clean, actually. They were covered in pollen. So it was coming down pretty hard, like I said, so let's see how dry they stayed out here. So I'm gonna unzip them and uh, check it out. This is a quick unzip. Oh, yep. Nice and dry, good job. Yeah, so these things have held up thus far only had them for about a month up here but yeah I just wanted to check to see if they actually work and everything seems to be very dry and as you can see it's a little damp out there okay so thanks for watching and thanks to uh, bougie RV uh, for sending out the roof bags they're uh, really cool I think they make a bunch of other products I can't vouch for them but I do like these bags and they had them and they sent them and I needed them and we're stoked so thanks guys 
and uh, like and subscribe we got tons of van life content and yeah danny's chopping some onions yeah guys thanks for watching we love you Thank you.